Nutritionist Patrick Holford posted an article to his blog on 29th of March called Case for Vitamin C for COVID-19. And he says, There are five compelling reasons why high-dose oral and intravenous vitamin C should be trialled on critically ill COVID-19 patients to speed up recovery time spent in ICU and reduce mortality. Number one, two registered trials, one in China, one in Italy, are underway. Preliminary results show no deaths in critically ill patients. All improved and there was no mortality. Patients who received high-dose IVC had a hospital stay about three to five days shorter than the overall patients. There were no side effects reported from any of the cases treated with high-dose IVC. Two New York hospitals are reported using IVC with good results. And the Shanghai Medical Association endorsed vitamin C for the treatment of COVID-19 infections. Number two, high-dose vitamin C speeds up pneumonia recovery. A 2018 study of 56 patients with severe pneumonia given 6 grams of oral vitamin C daily reported an 85% drop in mortality and double the rate of radiologic improvement in the lungs after a week. Number 3. Cold duration is 20% shorter and symptoms less severe. Number 4. Vitamin C shortened stay in ICU. An oral dosage of 1-6 to grams a day of vitamin C shortened ventilation time on average by 25%. And finally, number 5, vitamin C is safe. No adverse effects have been reported in any trials giving high-dose oral or intravenous vitamin C to those with influenza, colds or pneumonia. Vitamin C is not patentable and inexpensive, and therefore no trials will be funded by the pharmaceutical industry. There remains an unjustifiable media and medical bias against vitamin C, despite evidence to the contrary for trials using 6 grams a day or more, or IV. But what do you think about this? Feel free to post a comment below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And subscribe too if you'd like to see more videos like this in future. Until next time, I wish you the very best of health.